Today I'm going to share with you how to run Multi Instant on Apple Silicon Mac that helps you to play multiple games account within an Android emulator. And it's not just about how to set it up, I'm also sharing tips on emulator optimization to help you achieve stable and optimal performance. So first thing first, we need an Android emulator and personally, I always go with Moomo Player Pro for four main reasons. It's stable, run natively on Apple Silicon Mac, it's great for multi-instant and very easy to install. All you have to do is follow the first link in the description and click on try free. Once you get the file, double click to open it and simply drag it directly into the application folder to complete. And when you open it for the first time, you will see it's already created the first Android device. Now there's two ways to create a new instant. The first one is to click on this plus icon and select between creating a tablet or phone, which will depends on the application that you are intend to use. The second way is to clone directly from the existing device. This will be very convenient if you are going to use similar application across all of your instant. And with that, the setup process is pretty much done, but the most important part will be allocating the spec to X instance so they can run most efficiently. We'll start by clicking on more options and selecting settings. Now the first two things that I need you to focus on are device and GPUs model. For the device model, choose from different presets to see which work best for your app. As Moomo Player Pro did mention, some games are optimized to run better on specific models. For the GPU's model, choose between high, mediums, or low profiles based on how graphic intensive your application are. Moving to the display tab where you can set the device resolution using preset from HD to 4K or customize your own aspect ratio and DPI. You will also find options like FPS counters, auto rotations, and graphic enhancement. Just enable them based on your preferences. Now in the performance tab, this is where you allocate your Mac resources to the Android device. And as usual, Moomoo already provides some presets, which you can select based on the game you intend to run. For example, high performance is ideal for graphic intensive games like Jensen Impact, why balance and energy saving mode are better suited for 2Ds or lighter games like Class of Clans. And just to make sure you don't overload your Mac with too many instants, after you finish the customization, just run on the instant for the first time and open the activity monitor. Now check the CPU tab, the usage should be around 50 to 70%. Then check the memory tab, as long as the memory pressure stay green, things should be running nice and smooth. If not, you might need to tweak the instant spec or cut down on how many are running at once. Also, turning off optimized graphics and lowering the resolution can really have things run more stably. So it might take a few trials to get the best setting for your instant, but trust me, it's totally worth your time. And since we're sharing the same interest about Android emulator, I will highly recommend you to check out this video where I share how to run it 24 seven on a VPS. And on that video, I just share some of the custom macro that can help you run some of your repetitive tasks on game so you can farm you can do some ultimate tasks like there's a lot of things you could do with that so make sure you check out the videos other than that thank you all for watching and i'll catch you on the next one